Hello there, and how's everybody doing today? Um, I am playing for you right now. You're going to see what isn't necessarily the best drum solo we ever did, but without a doubt, it is my favorite drum solo that we've done in 20 plus years in Dark Star Orchestra. This was our first performance at Red Rocks in July of 2018. And we were uh, we were recreating a show from 40 years to the night earlier, a Red Rock show from uh, July 8th, 1978. And in 78, uh, during the drum solos, most of the time, quite a bit throughout that year, they would bring out, the crew would play, and Jerry would come back out. Most of the band members would come back out. Uh, the crew, the children, all kinds of people. And Jerry would play steel drums a lot during those. They were just starting to bring in a bunch of extra percussion. So uh, here at Red Rocks, we did the same, and we set up pretty much every drum we owned except for the ones that hang behind us, and it was incredible. We had, I think, 40 people on stage with us, you'll see, and it was all of our family members. They had all come out for the show, so you'll see my wife holding my son, who's only just turned two at that point. Not even. He's just about to turn two, and Levi, my other boy, is seven in it. We have... Dino's little girls banging on the gong, our, my sisters, my brother-in-law, my nieces, my nephews, all of our stage crew and their families, all the guys in the band, Skip's son is back there, Rob Eaton's daughter, just everybody, all the wives, everybody you can imagine, and uh, some friends of ours also who were drummers. Uh, it was just amazing, the energy that was going on, having all those people out there. We were already on such a natural high just from playing at Red Rocks and the energy and the spirit that was flowing through there. And then to add in being able to share it in such an intimate way with all of our families and friends and actually have them on stage with us. And you can see everybody smiles, you know, musically, it might not be the best thing in the world, but, uh, it would, it, it, it's hard to describe. It was just really an incredible day all the way around. And, uh, that was certainly the highlight of the show for me. So this is Red Rocks in July of 2018, uh, the Dark Star Orchestra Percussion Ensemble, if you will. I hope you all enjoy it.